All right, we're back here on the Zone postseason special. Anthony Callen here with you tonight. You can, you know, hear the roars from uh, Benford Boulevard anytime Heritage Christian has a home basketball game. That's because odds are Miles Colvin just did something just ridiculous, folks. Our Angel Morian caught up with the future Purdue Boilermaker as he finishes out his season with the Eagles. He does some things that um, shocks me. Miles Colvin is electric. <laughs> The Heritage Christian senior averages over 20 points a game. The question is never, will he score, but how he'll do it. He took off from the right below the free throw line and dunked it. There are just things that every two or three months that it, it takes me to a place of in awe. A lot, a lot of times I, I, I surprise myself like one game I threw the ball to the backboard and went and dunked it. So I think, I think that was something that's... It's just most of the time, it's, it's just instinct, and I, I just go and do it, and if I finish it, I'm like, wow, I really just did that. So I think it's after the games, that's really when it hits me, when you know, I realize I did something that's not really normal for other people to do. The rest of his game, well, that's just as elite as his shot making. It's quite shocking when I look at the film to see the usage of him, um, but what he does with the ball and off the ball, um, it does a lot for everybody else as well. Colvin's no stranger to success. His father, Roosevelt, was a linebacker at Purdue before going on to win two Super Bowls with the New England Patriots. Miles may be playing a different sport, sure. However, the foundation is exactly the same. I've seen, you know, through his daily life, he, he's a hard worker. He gets stuff done. So I think just carrying out that uh, that lifestyle and, and making sure I, I'm on top of everything that I have and you know, getting the job done. I think as long as I do that, then, then I'll get there. Miles will follow in his father's footsteps in one way, playing for the Purdue Boilermakers. Seeing Braden and Fletcher and see them start as freshmen, I think it, it really gives me hope and the opportunity to go in there and then just work hard and and, and start. And if, even if I don't start, just you know, keep working and, and helping the team win. Either way, he's excited to hear another Colvin name echo through Mackey Arena. Obviously, it's going to be an emotional moment. Try not to get too emotional, but I think uh, it's, it's going to be really sweet. I think it's something that, you know, obviously not a lot of people in the world get to experience just playing for one of the, you know, best teams in the country and also playing in one of the best arenas in the country. I think that's definitely a blessing, so I think can't wait for it. He's the, the, the baby boiler, and uh, we hope that um, he, he goes out there and does some special things for him. Like maybe one day, joining Dad in the Boilers Hall of Fame. Angela Morian, WishTV, WishTV.com, and follow us on Facebook. Uh, I know his parents are so proud of him. All the best there to Miles. Okay.